Well, here we are again in our Florican tunnel in the demonstration block. It's now the 16th of July. We've been picking for a, at least a couple of weeks now. Um, and I'd like to show you this selection that we're very excited about. It's been around for quite a long time. It's still a numbered selection rather than a named cultivar. This is Floricane 0658C5. Uh, started picking this year on the, the 3rd of July, so um, a few, quite a few days earlier than Glen Ampel did. Uh, and it has these beautiful, enormous fruit. And for several years, in several plots, it had the most productive crop with the, the largest fruit size out of any of our genotypes. And last year in this demonstration tunnel, this is the second year in this plot in Coya, it was the second highest yield in this plot. And it just blew away Glen D and Glen Ample. This uh, Floricane selection has Glen Ample as a parent, and all of Glen Ample's great traits have, have come through uh, into its progeny. In, in this case, it's a large number of fruit per lateral, good lateral length, nice strong laterals with a good display of fruit that's so easy to pick. Uh, with very high yields year on year. Well, because we've seen it in many trials at the Institute uh, over many years, this gives us the luxury of having consistent data to, to give to the growers um, and supplement their trial data. Uh, and this year you can see it's loaded with a, a very large fruit size uh, yet again so we're hoping to see some great yields again from it this year. We'll also include samples uh, for blind tasting uh, here at the, the Institute with our staff. In addition to its great performance in the breeding trials in soil and in substrate it was also involved in an Innovate UK project looking at different flavour profiles uh, conducted here at the Institute and it compared 13 different commercial cultivars with some of our own breeding germplasm and this one consistently came out top, coming out as uh, the preferential variety. This selection has gone to trial, its plants have gone out this year to some trialists, so we'll get uh, good feedback on what the industry thinks over the next couple of years. 